Okay, so if we have, again, we want to rationalise the denominator so that there's no thirds in the denominator of the fraction. The problem is this time, times in by root 2 plus 1 over root 2 plus 1, although this is times in by 1 in a clever way, we get... We still get a third in the denominator, which we don't want. Okay, so the way around this is to change the sign here and multiply through by root 2 minus 1 over root 2 minus 1. 1 times root 2 minus 1, and now expanding this double bracket, root 2 times root 2, root 2 times minus 1, root 2 times plus 1, and 1 times minus 1. This cancels with this, and so we're left with 2 minus 1, which is root 2 minus 1 over 1, which is root 2 minus 1. Right, so similar thing again, and this time instead of times in by root 5 minus 3, we want to times and change the sign round. So we're times in by root 5 plus 3 over root 5 plus 3. There's a single bracket expansion on the top and a double bracket expansion on the bottom. So 5 times root 5, 5 times 3, all over. Root 5 times root 5 is 5, root 5 times 3 is plus 3 root 5. Minus 3 times root 5 is minus 3 root 5, and minus 3 times 3 is minus 9. This cancels, so really we have 5 minus 9 on the bottom, we have an equivalent fraction to the original.